Mm -mm. I would be annoyed if Eli was 30 years old and brought a 19 year old home. He wouldn't bring a 19 year old home. And you are not about to get, no. You are not about to bring me home a 19 year old child. Somebody who could be my grandchild. You're not about to bring her home. Right. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gon' eat a little, crank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, this ain't no click bait. What's up y'all, it's Tasha and I'm back with another solo. Uh, before I get into the video, I wanna ask you guys to please thumbs it up if you like it. Uh, today I am having spaghetti, my favorite, salad and fried chicken, cause I saw Stephanie eat it the other day and I needed some. Uh, baby, can you do the intro part? Let's get into the video. All right y'all, fake back and I'm ready to eat. So, yeah, I know with my salad, if you don't know, now you know. Russian. I don't like salad with anything else. I mean, I'll eat salad if there's something else, but I prefer my salad with Russian dress. I have tomatoes, cucumbers, carrots, and spring mix. I have spaghetti and I have fried chicken. I'm putting this on it this time because I didn't put it, I usually put it in my spaghetti sauce, but I forgot. Y'all, I saw B-Love and Nate. Man, the, uh, today, eating spaghetti. Nate made that spaghetti look so good, the way he was eating it. He wasn't even talking. She was trying to talk to him. He was just like, huh, I'm eating. So, that's what's about to happen right now. I do have a topic. I'll get into it soon. Well, it's close. I'm close as hell. Mm -mm -mm. I think I have spaghetti recently. Um, but I wanted it again. I mean, we do seafood boils a lot. Why you can't do spaghetti a lot? I should just start doing straight spaghetti. I hope y'all doing good. Uh, me and Steph are doing well. Mm. I don't know if y'all want some salad, but here you go. I ain't offer no spaghetti because I'm scandalous. Don't know why I just blew that. Mm -mm -mm. I'm about to get into the chicken in one second. I'm get one more bite of spaghetti. I can't stand when the meat chooses not to. Come on, I need some, some ground turkey. I ain't about to say meat because I know how y'all are. Y'all and Stephanie. All right, here we go. Piece of chicken. I'm gonna do a bite. Mm. I'm gonna do sweet chili. Dip it in a little bit of sweet chili. Mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> Question for y'all. Are black people the only ones who do spaghetti and chicken? Because I know we do it. It's like a thing. It's just like baked beans with barbecue. Tell y'all the um, community tab thing right now, just so y'all can think about it before I start talking about it. It's, okay, your 18 year old being someone they have been dating to meet you for the first time. This person is 10 years older than them. What do you do? And does it matter if it's your son or daughter? Think about that. I basically said, you try to convince them that they're too young for the person. You accept them, age ain't nothing but a number, or you say nothing but you're upset. Or whatever it is you would do. What would you do? How would you feel? And if you are an 18 year old, are you dating somebody that's 10 years older? How did your parents react? Let me try it with the hot. This is extra hot, hot sauce.
is hot. I'm going to start by saying how I would feel. No, I'm going to let Stephanie say how she would feel so I can eat a little bit more. Actually. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Mmm. 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 Oh. It's hot? Mm-hmm. I was just rubbing it. I'm just playing, baby. <laughs> I didn't hurt her, y'all. Oh, you want to rub it? Okay, you just want to rub it? Okay. Mm -hmm. Sure. If my 18-year-old brought a 28-year-old home, basically. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't be happy. I would not be happy. Now, what would I do? Mm, I definitely would voice my opinion. Would you voice it right I'm in front of them? Say, <coughs> the person? Like no, this, you no. just met this person. Okay. No. I would not voice it in front of them. I would wait until they leave and then talk to my child about why I feel like they should date someone their own age. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, if they decided to continue, I would have to accept it. I mean, I'm not going to just keep harassing them about it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I'm going to hope that it, everything works out or whatever, or they can figure out what it is and move on with their life or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Whatever the case is. But, but yeah, I'm definitely going to say something and I, I wouldn't be happy. Do you feel like you would treat that person some kind of way? <laughs> be honest. You know, Even yeah. if it's not intentional? You know I would, kind of. I would probably be stank, a little stank. Like, I don't know. Eventually, I know I would get over it because I would have to. I'm not going to just do that forever. But yeah, I would be a little annoyed. Like, when I, even when I was younger and people that were, like, really a lot older than me, like when my, my friends would date 28 year old, 30 year old men when we were in high school, mm -hmm. I would be irritated as hell when, like, a, a man that old would talk to me. Mm -hmm. Like, why are you talking to me? 18 year that's you just fresh out of high you just what's wrong right a 28 year old has experienced a lot more life are you hungry no my mouth wet <laughs> it's always wet that's why you like it so much why not in my video not in my video okay yeah so um, i feel like i want my child to experience young life excuse me not the life of a 30 year old at 18. Okay, quickly, if Elijah came home with a 28-year-old woman at 18, first, my first question is, how long you been talking to this lady? Right. Uh -huh. <laughs> this woman. This lady. <laughs> okay, because you're 18, so I, I don't know what's going on, but I don't like it. You gonna pick that one? You the only drumstick I had? No, you can have it. Oh. I would, I would be upset. But I wouldn't say anything initially while she's there. The moment she walked out of the door, I would be like, like what, are you, what are you doing? Just explaining to him about the age difference, I think it's a problem because she's experienced some life and he hasn't. And she's going to expect things she should at least expect exactly. things and i don't feel like an 18 year old can give a 28 year old woman what she needs and he's going to be running trying to help her and even if she does really care about him because of something i'm not sure if he's always going to feel the same way so he might end up breaking her heart in the long run because he might want to not feel pressure and be with someone his age mm -hmm. okay so 69 percent said i would try to convince my child that they are too young for them Mm-hmm. Twenty-six percent said accept them, age ain't nothing but a number. And then five percent said say nothing but be very upset. Okay. So most people gonna say something. Right, most people so most people don't wouldn't like it. Like yeah. you know, they, they would not like it. I mm -hmm. thought it was gonna be higher people accepting it. Really? Because I feel like I a didn't. lot of people um feel like it's okay to date older. Like like I feel like a lot of women date older men. And feel like it's okay, and you know. And when they're older, that's true. I'm like, if you're 40 and he's 55, that's different. Right. 18 and 28 is different to me between. So that's what it is. 28 and 38. So it's the age of the people. Mm-hmm. Because when you're 28 and 38, you're you've matured. Right. 
When you're 18, you're still a kid. You just got out of your mama's house if you're not still in it. Yeah. You don't really know what's going on. I don't know why. And you still need to have fun and play around. A 28-year-old would want an 18-year-old. You know? I don't personally know either. But we both dated people that were yeah. older. Exactly. I think as a young person, I always wanted to be with somebody who was much more mature than me and that could teach me stuff and just i felt like i was um more mature than people my age so mm -hmm. i wanted that but then being the older person i couldn't see myself being okay with it <laughs> you know what i'm saying like mm -hmm. i don't know the mindset of that person right and, or understand it correct Oh, I'm sorry, so comments. You know, we were staring at me. I'm like, when you go? Oh, I thought we had the poll. Oh, we were just discussing. Oh, um, we were. <laughs> so, Valerie Simon said, I was pissed when my daughter brought home someone who could have been her father's age. Mm. But what do you do? Just support your kid and advise them on how to navigate the relationship. And he better not hit her because mama ain't playing that game. Okay. You better not hit her. I mean, I don't yeah. think just because somebody's older, it means they're going to abuse you. <laughs> he your daddy. <laughs> you getting a whooping. <laughs> Tam said, the more you try to split them up, the more you're pushed, you will push them together. I mean, I kind of agree with that. Because everything my parents didn't want me to do, I was trying to do it as fast as I could. Really? Yeah. I don't get that whole thing. Yeah, I was. But maybe it's because I didn't understand why. It was just like, mm -hmm. don't do this. Okay. You know? I think if you talk to your kids they will feel differently about the things you you give them advice on and not just like hey you don't need to be doing this okay okay anastasia lopez says what does an almost 30 year old have in common with a 18 year old at 28 i would think most people will be ready to start their life and have kids mm -hmm. their dream job house etc most 18 year olds are not mature enough for all that Unless this 28 year old still has a child mentality themselves, which is a red flag in itself. Yeah. So yes. their daughter, I'd say the same thing. Hell no. Yep. Mm -hmm. I agree. I agree with you completely, Miss mm -hmm. Lopez. I do. I just can't. I can't see my son with a 28 year old woman and just be happy about it. Knowing that uh, is she about to get him pregnant. Bro, what are you talking about, man? I mean, <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, she old enough, she might get him pregnant. You know, I don't have time. I don't need a grandchild at this time. Okay, so CJ, the review man, said none of the options. I would try to get to know them before judging them all. Mm -hmm. Judging them at all. We would talk after that. Okay. And then Nikita Smith said... It doesn't matter to me as long as they are getting treated right. Okay. Yeah. Some people are like that. And some, I think some marriages are, will possibly, I'm sure, have lasted with that age difference. You know? Melodrama said, even seven years older, older than me and my mama was not having it. Mm -hmm. She was like, nope. Emily McDaniel said, there are some things you just can't tell a teenager. They have to learn some things on their own. That's true. That's true. You can't really control someone, you know, especially when it comes to love. It's kind of hard. You kind of do have to let people go, but mm -mm. Mm -mm. I wouldn't want to. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm sorry. Jayana Lucas said I would accept them because I would want them to be happy. And if I wanted to date someone older than me and love and I love them, I wouldn't want my parents to try to break us up. So I wouldn't do that to them. Okay. No, yeah, that's understandable. I mean, you were in this situation pretty much, right? I was with somebody. Twenty-six. I was with somebody eighteen years. Oh, well, the other one was more. Oh, you talking about when I was underage? Yeah, I was seventeen. She was twenty-six. That's pretty much the same thing. Even uh -huh. worse because you are younger. <laughs> yeah, and she was horrible. I mean, or she you wasn't in a, high school. I finished high school early, but if I didn't finish high school early, I would have still been in high school. Yeah, I would have still been in high school when she was 26. But it was, is that she was a liar and I didn't, she didn't do me wrong or anything, you guys. But the point is, I was, I was young, I was naive and I wasn't able to detect a liar. She lied to me about her whole life. She had a girlfriend, I think she might have had a wife. 
but I'm her girlfriend. I had no idea because I was so young and so inexperienced. I had no idea that she had a double life. Right. She was, excuse me, the car she was driving wasn't hers. It was her girlfriend or wife. I don't ever know what the person really was. I mean, I didn't know because I was inexperienced. Right. And it's easy for an older person to lie and manipulate a younger person. But I was also manipulated by somebody who was three years younger than me. So. But as you got older, you're able to. Oh yeah, you can tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, mm. Should I buy a little bit? I don't know. Should I be? Uh huh. Okay. So I'm 19. I recently dated a 30 year old. My parents weren't mad because I was happy, and all they care and want is for me to be happy. Also, they just wanted to make sure the man I was with wasn't on BS or wasn't using me for anything, which he wasn't, so it worked out. I would accept it and be happy for my child as long as the person is treating them right and happy. Love has no age, unless they're under age 12, 16, I guess, unless they're between age 12 Okay. 16. She has the right to her opinion. <laughs> you still like to me, right? <laughs> Holla at me in two years. <laughs> Holla at me in a few years. Hopefully it works out, but I mean, I think mm, 19 and 30. Mm. I don't know why he wanted 19 year old. I'm sorry. I think that men are a lot less mature than women. Males are a lot less mature than females, but that still doesn't say, hey, okay, they're supposed to date. You know, but who's to say they're not supposed to? I, we ain't really saying that. We just doing, you know, everybody has an opinion. We're just stating ours from experience. I would be annoyed if Eli was 30 years old and brought a 19 year old home. He wouldn't bring a 19 year old home. And you are not about to get, no. You are not about to bring me home a 19 year old child. Somebody who could be my grandchild. You're not about to bring her home. Right. All right, y'all. Well, that's yeah. it. Thank you for answering all. Uh, thank you for responding to the poll. Yeah, I'm about to go, um, I'm about to go play PlayStation while Stephanie edits. Maybe I'll I'm read. Edits and slaves today. You are. We took a break, y'all, so now she gotta edit like, what, four or five videos? Yeah. Yeah, so. We love y'all, we appreciate you. Salvatore, don't forget to, um, well, we already been talking, so whatever, we found you. Congratulations to Salvatore for winning the $200 for the clock emoji. That raffle, or whatever you call it, is over. It's not a raffle, but y'all know, that thing is over. Love you guys, and we'll talk to you later. Uh, we got a link in the description below. Um, it's the vlog channel. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, set your notifications to all if you want to be reminded of daily uploads, live streams, and premieres. And until next time, only good vibes. Peace.